Hey Crusaders, so we've been talking a lot about swimming and using pool noodles for different workouts. Today we're going to continue to do that. We're going to use pool noodles to make shapes in the water while we're listening to some music. So one of the shapes that we're going to do is the letter C. And with the letter C, you can go either direction. Um, you can also make the letter with your body. So I'm going to show you what it looks like if you make the letter C with your body. Oh, I'm turning a little bit kind of hard to do when um, you're floating and staying suspended in the water. Make the letter C with your arms, with your back and your legs. It's a good letter to make. We could also make um, the letter V with our arms straight arms out or you can make it facing down and make it with your noodle it's a little bit harder to get it to, to bend that way there we go bend it a little bit better V you can make it with your legs straighten your legs in the shape of V Some of you all are really good at this. You can even bring them up out of the water. Um, another shape we can make, let's see, we've done C and B. We can try to make the letter O with our noodle or with our bodies. Letter O. Like O with my arms like this. My hands are touching. Try to fit my body inside my letter O, tucked up, all tucked up in a little ball. Put my noodle around me and make, make an O so I'm in the letter O. There's all kinds of shapes we can make. Um, we can even move in the water in those shapes. So. Instead of making our body or our noodle look like that shape, we can move in that shape like this. We could walk backwards in the letter C. Or we could swim forward in a circle. In an O. We could even float around in different shapes. We could do um, the letter S for swimming. Of course, the letter I is really easy to do. It's just a straight line. All right, so now it's time for us to experiment in the pool, making different shapes. Bye, Crusaders.